So my normal rule is about three things, I guess. It's about how it is our DNA is maintained, because it's quite fragile. It's about how it is that uh, cancer develops based on DNA damage and the failure to repair that damage properly. And I guess it's about how we can understand better ways to treat cancer through knowing that some of those cancers fail to repair their DNA properly. I guess those who would benefit from coming to the inaugural would be students, medical students, um, BMED science students, and really anyone who's interested in how it is our DNA is kept the right sequence in the right place, how cancer develops and what the molecular machines inside our cells do to help that. Our research is important, I guess, because it attempts to improve cancer therapies. So chemotherapy is a nasty experience for many patients. And if we could pinpoint the right treatment for the right tumour, even on the individual level, we should be able to improve the treatment efficiency for that patient and moreover not treat patients who wouldn't benefit from that modality. And I guess I'm passionate about it because I like finding out how things work. And I like working with other people who like finding out how things work and I guess I'm, I'm really very lucky to get to do this for a living. Oh, it means a great deal to be doing my inaugural lecture. I'm privileged to be head of a lab who are very productive, very enthusiastic and it's going to be great to be talking about what they've done over the last nine years. Also it's quite an honour to be joining those heroes and heroines of mine already here at Birmingham um, as a professor. <laughs>